I'm in Asamir and there's the beautiful hotel, Hotel Chariot, and then that says the beach. Uh, I don't know what kind of beach is back there, it's saying the beach club. And they told me if I go straight here, it's a beautiful walk. So I'm waiting for my friends to come take me to dinner, Samuel and Susan, who are my my family here in Amsterdam and uh, but today I decided to stay in a hotel because it's just so nice to uh, come in and uh, not have to anybody wait on me and, and then I rested and it's just beautiful wow so I'm gonna walk this way a little bit there's another hotel there and this is a village but i just love europe because you can go walking anywhere instead of walking place for exercise you just walk to the store you walk to the bakery uh, and i remember years ago we took bicycles i wasn't so sure about being on the bicycle on the road but they have everywhere they have paths the bicycles go but i guess it's very cold i haven't seen Okay, yes, just amazing how God leads us, brings us to places that he has planned. Um, and tomorrow, Lord willing, I go to meet a very precious lady that I have never met before, an Armenian lady who lives in Belgium, two hours away by train, and to meet her. And we are going to do a Zoom meeting together. To, she said she has more than 40 women joining her. So uh, she wants me to ring the word. I mean, just amazing. Oh, look at this. This is just beautiful. And the weather is like maybe 40s uh, to 50s maybe, which I love. Actually, Baton Rouge was very cold this morning or yesterday when we were going to the airport. And I told Terry, I said, it's good. I have a scarf and a coat on. And I said, it's good that I'm dressed for Europe, but I needed to dress like that in Baton Rouge too. Look at this. This is Holland. I love Holland. I used to come here so often with daddy for meetings and just love being here. And the houses, there's a certain style to them. They look like they have big, big, windows and not many people put curtains on their windows which is very strange but they like it that their living rooms are you can see it if i go by a house i would take a picture there's a road again a street and uh, he said right here if i go to the right it's a street he told me it would be a beautiful walk so I'm just gonna go a little bit. Oh, goodness. Okay, Bobo. There is a beautiful, beautiful street. And she said, he said, machine, machine of This one, she, he said, if I walked, would be beautiful to see. Of course, Holland has canals and I can see how green everything is because the waters, they have such waterways everywhere. There's my Schienewerk. Yeah. So, this is my... So a few days ago, I was thinking I need to walk for exercise and here I am. Yeah, this is my kind of walk. And look at this garden house and garden and uh, so beautiful and they have pumpkins out and then a shop this 
closed. Sweet little shop. I thought they would be decorated more for Christmas right now, but not yet. Maybe this weekend it will be. Uh, how beautiful. Everything is decorated for fall. Another store. Like it's snowing because the rain, uh, I think it's very little rain right now, like it's drizzling, but it feels like snow on my face. Oh, there's somebody sitting at her window. I wonder if you can see her. They won't like it. If they know it. Ah. One day we were in a village like this with my dad and he was having meetings very close and I just um, had decided to go walking. Terry had gone to Utrecht on the bus so I decided to go walking and all of a sudden on the other side I saw my dad coming and it was just so incredible to meet him uh, in the middle of this village. And we went and sat together and had french fries and coffee and uh, just yeah i miss i miss those things but we look ahead all that the lord has for us typical house across the street and there it is just the styles, I mean, not so different with the bricks, but different with their roofs and the styles of their roofs. Okay, that should give an idea of Al Samir. So. Da. Hello. Hello. 